ladies and gentlemen. Welcome, welcome, welcome to another vloggy vlog. As we are calmly and gently chilling and cruising. Go ahead, you got this. You got this, little fam. Um, yeah, it's a Thursday. And uh, I'm feeling a little bit better than I did in the last vlog where I was cranky. Cranky, cranky. But today is a busy day. I have a ton of shit to do. A ton of stuff. Oh, I gotta stop swearing so much. What's the point of uh, all the cussing? There is none. What's going on here? Get ahead. Get ahead with these slow folks taking their sweet time. Madness over here. Lots of confusion. We're just gonna get ahead. Don't know where they're going. That's okay. So yeah, there's just uh oh look at that the electric F-150, so cute. But yeah, it's just like a just a nice day. It's a nice relaxing day. Oh look, it's a dude on a monster. Adorable. Is that a monster? No, it's a Suzuki S SV650, I think. Yep. Just as adorable as a monster, really. Be a beautiful day, folks out in uh, shorts and dresses and whatnot. It's weird. I had uh, only one cup of coffee and I feel caffeinated like wild man. So I need to, uh, yeah. One, one topic I wanted to talk about was uh, planning some summer rides. I got some exciting rides planned. Uh, Um, well, not some, just one really, just one exciting ride to uh, Canada, to Quebec. That's gonna be good. It's uh, we're going to the the Devil's Nipple, as we call it, the Devil's Nipple, which is uh, actually not what it called what's called at all. I gotta fix this. This is not acceptable. Um, it's not called that at all, but it's up. Uh, it's like the circular crater of sorts but I'll, uh, I'll, I'll, I'll put the name of it in the description or whatever I forgot the name of it now oh look at this car that's a power move bro that's a power move right there in a car especially running a red light and all sick so yeah but what will happen is that it's exactly a thousand miles from New York City which is perfect you know and uh, we would need to take a ferry we don't need to take a ferry but we can and we will so that's gonna be fun. I like taking ferries with the bike. Strap the baby down and all. You are the worst driver ever, bud. I'm gonna have to pass you. What are you freaking doing, bud? Freaking guy. Look at him. You're scared, bud. You're scared. Now we lost our chance because now we got now we got trucks and cars in front of us. It's okay. It's gonna be all right. So, um, yeah, it's gonna be exciting. And uh, I'm going with my buddy Russell. Uh, he's got uh, a triumph of sorts, of kinds, and it's gonna be a, it's gonna be a hoop. We're gonna stay in some hotels, some cabins, some uh, some uh, other things. You know, it's 
going to be a live situation. We're not going to really like overbook everything and uh, just, you know, down to the last second. I usually fly around. Kind of could, but I don't want to. But yeah, it's gonna be a, uh, it's gonna be fun. It's gonna be a nice little 2,000 mile round tripper, and uh, I'm obviously gonna end up in Maine and Vermont and all that, because that's all I know apparently. It's all I know. That said, I want to plan some more trips. I don't want that to be my only uh, adventure. I want to go farther, more distance. So, and I have a couple more weeks to do that. You know what I mean? So it's not even like I'm uh, lacking for time. It's just uh, the effort, I guess. Ooh, look at that license plate. That's cute. Yeah, because it takes uh, takes effort to go on these far trips. And now I'm stuck here. I'm not really in a splitting mood, but I might have to. I don't think I have a choice. So I'm trying to decide because like the other tr trip I wanted to do was to Barber, to uh, Alabama. Could do both. You know, could go to Canada and to Alabama. It actually wouldn't be uh, such a terrible, terrible thing to a barber museum. The problem with Alabama is like, in the summer, we looked it up. I mean, maybe some of you guys are from around there, from around Alabama, but uh, it's like 95 degrees with 100% humidity. It sounds like it's gonna be bug central. Bug central, humidity central. gonna be all right but look at me doing it by the book well I kind of want to talk to you guys that's why oh look at this building this building is dope I would live here I would even take the the top balcony there not a bad place actually a little bit far from the train G train is your nearest and I'm not the biggest fan of the G train at the moment I'll be honest But it is exciting to uh, plan these things because uh, you gotta like, because we're gonna head out early, get some food, you know, cruise. It's nice to have as many miles as you want. Oftentimes, nowadays, we ride, uh, there's an end in sight at all times. I mean, here as well, but at least for the first half of the trip when we're on the way out, it's marvelous. And it's gonna be all new. That's my biggest thing. I wanna see new areas. I wanna see new spots. New towns, new turns, new little forests and fields. Could have already been there, but I'm doing taking my sweet time. It's okay. This is probably the most calmest I've ever been on this uh, commute. I like it. I like it a lot. Oh, this guy is gonna turn off on top of it. Look at this. Look how calm, look how chill. Oh, I'm like a little poster child. Did I do anything illegal on this ride? I honestly don't think so. And look, we even got a cop over there. That's adorable. And that's gonna create some good vlogs too, this long ride. 
I'm gonna record the whole thing, obviously, and just, uh, yeah, you know. Have fun with it. I'm gonna get up a little bit, because I don't really particularly want to be uh, all the way back here. Trying to decide if I'm gonna get a breakfast sandwich or not. We should. And yeah, another thing about all these long adventures, you get to like pack your gear. You get to like grab all your little equipment and little uh, this and that. I'm excited. I need to do another one. I need to do more than just one, you know? Even if it's not gonna be another 2,000 miler. Maybe it could be a. Uh, a smaller boy, smaller adventure. Ooh, look, they're repainting it. Let's go. Here we are. Come on. Look at these folks. So cautious. Maybe I'm just reckless. But I don't understand the point of going like 14 miles per hour there. Yeah, we'll never make this light. It just doesn't happen. Look at that. My boy. My boy shining up his machine. Yeah, we'll take a left as well. Totally fine. Plus, Canada is just fun. They speak French there, and they're freaking, uh, you know eat eat a little bit different it's gonna be quaint have some nice coffees out there some pastries and whatnot this guy in the Tesla is a straight bitch I gotta stop saying that though that's a bad word to say but he is a very very uh, safe driver probably could learn a lot Fuck is this shit? <laughs> Second, I try not to swear, things fall apart, and swearing comes out. Swearings come out. I apologize. This bike is just buttery smooth. We're just having a hoot. We're having a holler. There we go. We'll stop here again. There we go. Hmm. I could go over there. Oh no. I can't. That's fine. Right by these cones. And move them over just a bit like that. That was relatively calm. It was like almost enjoyable. Good lord. Alright boys and girls. I'll talk to you soon, okay? I'm gonna get in character now. Become a real man.